Hey there, hi there, hello there, and welcome to another Narjan Reacts. In this video, we're reacting to The Owl House Season 2, Episode 13. So, without further ado, let's get right into it. Now, oh, starting right off with the Emperor's Castle. Hey, Hunter. Yeah. And it Rascal. Good as new. Sure. And I have no idea what I'm doing. I don't think, yeah, you definitely don't. Hi. From Emperor Bellows. <laughs> I love how you still see on his back the stitches and the tape and the band-aid. Oh wait, the get started. illusion cup in here? I'm gonna, I, I, hey Rain. Hey Tara. Nah, don't you keep a, wait, that one, wait, the one has a tail. Good morning to you too, little friends. We decided friends. to reschedule the meeting. <laughs> this is impressively bad. Wait. Wow. Is this the old Golden Guard sit? Of course it is. How dare you put the old Golden Guard? <laughs> I knew your predecessor. He was my mentor. Oh. Oh, predecessor. And I say you don't deserve to wear that patch. Ish. Wait. Then maybe you can get this back. Is he gonna try and get Amity and Luce on his side or to join them? I'll do it. Of course you will. You're very good at doing exactly what you're told. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Okay. Wait, what? Wait. Woo. Dude, was that a cutoff again? Were we getting a shorter intro than before? They did, they cut it right there. Okay, I don't mind because that just means more of the actual episodes, so time with me. Any sport in a storm. Oh my gosh, what is this freaking rocky? After years of thinking I wasn't good enough. <laughs> the way her bee is holding her feet. I'm on my way to becoming the witch I wanna <laughs> be. He's also doing the rope. I can do this. Oh wait. Ah, oh, she's got the ground photo on her mirror. The ghouls celebrate their first flyer derby win. Knock them dead. Not literally though. In the Azura Book Club. <laughs> Thanks, but I was about to say, wouldn't all those books weigh a lot for one you to hold in one hand? I'm clear and face paint. I am so excited Rock? to hear next words out of your mouth. Flyer Derby! Only stab the Jenkins and all go Oh, okay. Club fair. Wait. Hold up, I just see... Oh, I see the Good Witch Azura Art Club swimming. Something with a giraffe. Uh, I can't read the three on the back right. Or the fourth one. Arts plus witchcraft. And the W is freaking in Disney's uh, style. Or Disney font. Are you cruising for a bruise? <laughs> that's perfect. Screeching debate. Hey, that's how a lot of debates go online. down for ages 6 to 11. <laughs> That's what Disney wished the show was turned into. Touching a book by its cover is a baby rule, even babies know. Plus, yeah, Bisha. For the art. There's so much magic I just noticed that there's a freaking Mona Lisa painting on the side with a single eye. The smell of the pages. <laughs> I was kidding. I thought I, I've done that before with books too. Sometimes they smell like, especially good in yours, like <laughs> as you flip through the pages. <laughs> Am I the only one? Actually, no. Luce did it too, sort of, kind of. So. Luce. Oh, hey, Emmy. I heard that Spillin' Hermosa, the author of Did she just call her Hermosa? Azura is having a signing. What does that even mean? This afternoon at the Book Nook. Huh? You are much <laughs> less excited than I imagined. Uh, excuse me, I'm still here. I'm just confused. You are? The author is human. Can the author of Azura travel between realms? Get off me! That's the smart idea. Sell her books to both different uh worlds. Yeah. What's the matter, jealous Bisha? So I still have more friends than you. Oh, uh huh. I don't think they care. Look at all these potential recruits. Oh my God, Hunter's gonna try and recruit people here. Actually... Classmate, ignore uh -huh. the fact that we've never met. What if I told you all your dreams sweating. come true? And you just have to leave your home, friends, and family forever. Uh, yeah, sounds <laughs> <really>. <laughs> Oh, hey, it's 
you guys. Cool I hear you get to sleep in till 6 a.m. Banish card. You. Eh, not interested. You aren't. You aren't. <laughs> that voice crack. When I get older, I'm gonna give this system a long overdue update. What are you talking about? <laughs> oh. Oh, hey, it's puddles. Oh, you're stepping out of his tail. Hunter's gonna come running by, being chased by by puddles. Put together a team for a friendly game of flyer derby after school. That's him when he was younger. Team to victory. Oh, they're gonna get Hunter. Oh, this music. Sure. This what choice does he have? I'm, your flying was amazing. You're a new student, right? Yeah. Sure. Weird. We've never seen you around. Oh, leave everyone at the top of a mountain and see who makes it back to the bottom alive. <laughs> Classic. Um. He... Does this mean that Hunter had to do all that to get where he? Okay. I don't know what kind of mission you're on, but it's been a tough year for Willow, and she's really looking forward to making this team a thing. Protective bestie. Do you think she's related to that human guy, Philip? Mm. The author is Ida. She's been keeping it secret this whole time because she's embarrassed. I don't think so, Luz. Okay, these theories are a little unrealistic. Yeah, and I should know about theories being unrealistic. <laughs> I think we can really get our derby team approved. This girl will be a perfect candidate for the Emperor's Cup. They're both using each other. Like Let's try this one more time. Going backwards. <laughs> she. Ow. Just okay, girl. Don't let the power get to your head just yet. Huh? <laughs> There's like I'm out of here. Give him a chance. Well, where I come from? Hmm. The way where he's standing right in front of a mirror is he gonna turn his head and see his own reflection and realize that he's the same way where people are underestimating him just with the way he looks. He <laughs> he yeah. Even. Sorry, Captain. Good luck with your match. Or it was a uh, symbolism with him. <laughs> well, honestly, Willow's scary if you piss her off. She can literally just suck you into the earth and let you suffocate. Now I'm only scarred emotionally. I'm only scarred emotionally. And Viney's the best healer in school. Yeah, that's what happens when you judge a book by its cover. So, still think we're pathetic? I like this, like... Music for this episode so far. Let's get our game faces off. Oh, of course you had to do face paint. What do we do now, Andy? Oh, look at them leaning on each other. Oh, oh hello. Is it Little Nose? It's not Little Nose, nose, is it? Mildred, oh, Ow. I've done that before, Reese. <laughs> nah, I think that's Little Nose. I think that's freaking Little Nose. Also, um. What is it? Hit, the way Luz hit her head on the back or something. I've done that before where I've like been like this and I like, do it too fast and I hit my head on something. Call Jerry. You just, you're dragging Luz, I mean, Amity with you, Luz. Oh. Jerbo? Trainer. Let's see what you can do, Captain. I love all the palismans lined up. <laughs> oh. Didn't think it's it. That's seriously. Guys. One. That was amazing. <laughs> He's Hunter's gonna get a taste of what it feels like to actually work with like a team and a, a real team and not one that puts you down and all that stuff. And then he's gonna go back to the Emperor. Hunter's gonna have stuff stacked over and over on him to show him how like bad things are at the at the castle and with the Emperor versus like if he went and like actually was allowed to be a teenager and stuff. Oh uh, what? What did you two think that was gonna happen? Oh. Oops, my hand slipped. Wow. Yay! In your face, Professor. Oh, oh Kool Aid. You gotta dump the Kool Aid on. Shoot, he never thought of a name. The Poison Ivy. Entrails. Emerald you know, entrails. We're green, and there's more to us than you think. <laughs> that look he made at the end was like. It's like, did I make the right choice? Andrews, Andrews. Andrews, team photo. We're 
<laughs> Wait, isn't entrails also like inner like intestine? I, I don't remember. I feel like entrails was like, yeah, something in your body. <laughs> Always nice making a new friend. I had an opening for one. <gasps> we wouldn't have <laughs> Gasp. <laughs> forget all about that and until play next time he's about to save for the emperor isn't he and then they're all going to be against them oh hunter as a part of the emperor's coming <gasps> oh and there won't be any delay in branding you with coven sigils and taking you away from your friends and family forever hooray hunter <laughs> hunter <laughs> okay listen i'm sorry about this whole cell thing but did you really have to punch Steve, Skara? Yes. Emotions are running high. I... <laughs> the indent. You're joining the best coven there is. You can keep all your magic. Against their will. Room and board. You can even play flyer derby on your day off. Well, this year's day is already passed. But oh. next year's only 52 weeks away. We don't care. You hear yourself, None Hunter? They sure they do. The coven heads do it all the time back at the castle. That's Captain, not normal. You're on my side, right? Take this and quit bugging me. All for a cloak. I can wear this proudly now. And look what it costs you. Can you? Oh, See Darius. The castle. <laughs> oh, classic. And of course, Bellas likes to collect everyone's palace men. No! Steve is beginning to regret his choices. <laughs> I think Hunter is too. Yeah. This is little nose. This is so freaking little nose. And if it's not, I'm. Look how little it is. You know what she reminds me of? She reminds me for anyone who's ever played Spiral, like the. Well, you can you could have played the remastered version, but like remastered or the uh, the old version. But in Spiral, the original games, you had the little egg snatcher guy that was like wearing a cape, and he'd be like, nee, 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 and like run around. This. <laughs> Says, remind me of the way she moves. <laughs> no, nah, that blast. That's the same blast that little no little nose used on freaking King. That's little nose. The hair color, how small. No. I'm sorry. There's no love or anything in Kiki's heart. She would not be able to write fiction like Azura. And the fact that she sounds like little nose. Tanella Nosa? She's Tanella Nosa. That's her. I'm still calling her little nose. Sorry, boss. The jig is up. <gasps> Tibbles? Tibbles? Edited a few more of those author photos, boss. Metholomew? Some of my finest work. <gasps> Loose? According to the owner of the book nook, he's only ever had one customer purchase from the series. Emily. I, I didn't know. I swear. Were you expecting some dramatic discovery? <laughs> Deserved. Thank you, Amity. Oh, the way she leans in. I love them. They're so cute and sweet. Make a right hunter. I'm sorry. Did I just see freaking? Like Lilith on there with the chili lily. Also, that was worth it. I wanted to see him that happen again. Rainy day, choose your fighter. The owl lady. Nerd, return my calls. More comments. Wait, so that's freaking rain and Ida's leaving comments on their posts. Chili Lily, new pigment, new ink to survive. Look at tomorrow's review. Hashtag ink bad girl. Pens to good. Cool. Alabomdor. Meet the 2.5. Who is the hack now? Amira. Dad, this is. Oh my god, is that Emmy? Oh no, that's M. Dad, this is embarrassing. Throw up emoji. Uh, that's great. Mute. Nope. Uh -uh. <laughs> she he bapped her on the head. Now. Run! Mm. Oh, freaking, <laughs> freaking Gus Casley just tilts over the edge like that. Music. I like the music in this episode. I don't know this. Did you really think 
you could get away with endangering a coven head. Yeah, careful. There is a scary. Idea what I'm capable of. Yeah, but I don't think that's gonna stop them. We need to find a replacement. After all, it'll be 52 weeks before Caleb's next day off. Oh, oh, Willow. <laughs> she just told Hunter that they'll wait for him until his day off to play. Oh, <laughs> don't make me tear up. <laughs> them, and then you disobeyed me to protect them. Yeah, is Darius gonna please? I'm impressed. <gasps> I had you all wrong, Darius. Huh, Sixteen. It's about time you made connections outside the castle. <laughs> Wait, is Darius actually, actually turning out to be a good guy? Wait, is Darius... Is Darius the one out of the coven heads that's gonna be like... Mm. I think you'll make your predecessors proud. Oh. <laughs> Wait, he's gonna fix it? But you could still use a sewing lesson. <laughs> yeah, are we, gonna, are we actually like Darius? Wow. He is a slow typer. <laughs> He's worse than my dad. He's worse oh, than my dad. Hey guys. Just had our first team win is the Emerald Entrails. Na 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 na. Let me see, let me see. Right. <laughs> 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 like, what, Hunter? <laughs> well, hey, you two have the first thing for your uh, writing prompt. I don't like that image of Rain being wrapped up in Terra's vines and stuff, like to show that he's trapped. That they're trapped. I'm so sorry. They, they. <laughs> uh, I love how I said they through like every moment, every other moment in this episode, but then the moment where I'm just like, <laughs> don't mind me. Uh, anyway, all right, let me get into my thoughts. <laughs> all right, so that was episode 13. Oh, oh, season two of Owl House. All right. Ooh, this one was good. It was Hunter focused, and I'm not objectifying at all because Hunter is definitely become, I think, one of my favorite characters um, in the series. Uh, so I'm happy to see him kind of get to experience uh, being a teenager, uh, like a normal teenager. But of course, they had to make it where him being indoctrinated into the Emperor's thing at the end would not understand and be like, you guys are gonna be happy, you know, joining Emperor. Come on, you don't understand this? And then it's like, it takes, it takes for a hit, like to see Willow like upset and stuff and to realize, yeah, maybe I'm starting to re regret this or feel guilty in my decisions. I love how Steve freaking, now I know why you all brought up Steve like in the first season, like I'm still waiting on the crikey thing. I still, who the fudge is this crikey? Is it one of the coven heads that says crikey? I swear. <laughs> I want to know who it is. I, if it's like, it, it, I don't think it's King's grandpa, father, whoever that is that's arrived. Because he's spoken and we've never heard him say crikey. So it's got to be someone of the coven heads that speaks that says crikey. I really feel like it is. Mm. Um, but yeah, anyway. Uh, yeah, hunter, hunter centric episode with a little bit of, you know, Amity and Lumini. Like a little Amity and Lumini like side story of them finding out who... Uh, the author is for Azura the Good Witch, um, which I love was like a mixture. It wasn't really, there wasn't any writer found out. It was just like the one selling it on the Boiling Isle side was, I love how it was Tibbles, Metholomule, Little Nose. That was the three of them, right? Yeah, it was the, those three. I love how they incorporated those characters into something like that. And of course, Tibbles wanted to run a scam, but it didn't work. Um, so... Now we know that it's a human that, so it must have been that the reason why there's a photo of a human version of the author and the, the witch version is because Tibbles changed the photo, which is easy enough to do. <laughs> Who needs Photoshop when you have magic? Um, but yeah, I liked it. It, it. it was a good episode. Uh, and I love that Darius turns out to be, his turned out to not be a bad guy. Like, okay. I feel like... <laughs> Darius might be keeping a front, obviously, for Bellos, like, when he's been ordered, like, him and, um, Everborn, whatever that, the Beastkeeping Coven head, head's name is, um, when 
Bellos ordered them to capture Rain. Like, obviously, Darius couldn't go against that, so he had to go and try and capture Ida and take in Rain. Um, but he seemed very like it didn't look like he felt bad at all. It felt very much like not nah, like like he did very. If he is was faking it, like trying to put up a front, he did a very good job at that because it, it definitely came across as. A guy like he was the kind of guy that just is believes in the, the uh, emperor's cause and everything like that. So the fact that he is like, you know, Hunter's like, are you gonna tell Emperor Bellos? And he's like, are you gonna tell him about? <laughs> so it's like, I, I like, I kind of like Darius now. I don't know if I fully trust him yet. Like I don't know if he's like, at, like maybe he's got a soft spot for Hunter. And and I mean. Okay, here's the thing. He wasn't going to take in Willow and them because, like he said, they were already full. But if they hadn't been full, he probably would have taken them in. So it feels like he doesn't go above what needs to be done. So, like, it's like, what's the point? There's no point in bringing them in when we're already full. So I'm just going to drop them off the hex side. So he's not someone like, let's say if it was Kiki or probably Terra, it would be, uh, I'm just going to dump them in the ocean and get rid of them. Or we're going to bring them in and, you know, have them just in case we lose any members, like, kind of thing. It was more like, no, there's no need. So just drop them off back home. Um, and things. So, and he also fixed Hunter's cloak. But, yeah, I'm like, I like, I like Darius now. Like, I don't, like I said, I don't trust him, um, yet. But I'm definitely liking him more. I, I like his personality. Like he was funny at first, where it's like you ruined my my cape, <laughs> kind of thing. Um, yeah, no, I wasn't expect. I, it's funny because it's funny because I thought Tara was gonna be the coven head that I would be like, oh, she'll turn out to be good. But for the rest, I wasn't. I didn't think Darius would turn out to be. I thought maybe even like uh, Everwolf would. Um turn out to be like good but for Darius to be the one hmm I'm not like I'm not complaining I, I like him <laughs> um and I like the kind of like almost maybe not uncle role because I mean that's what Bellos is for Hunter but um like Darius has been like that almost protective bigger brother I don't know not father figure I don't think but more like bigger brother protective of Hunter um so yeah, I mean, overall, the plot for this episode was great. Characters were great. Um, of course, Luz and Amity were adorable together, and I just love, I love the little interactions they have, like just like when they sit at the, like after finding out that the, uh, like the thing, the thing with the author was canceled, like Luz leaning on Amity and them sitting against the wall together, or like, it's just the little, and I noticed too, it's a lot more of Luz leaning on Amity, because Luz, well, I mean, they were both disappointed over the author thing, but like Luce was more so. So I wonder if Amity would lean on Luce, but it seems more like Luce is the one leaning on Amity. So I wonder if that's more of a personality thing where Luce will be the one to lean on Amity more than Amity does. Because Amity will have more of that. I don't know. But it's adorable. It's like, they're cute. I love I, I, I love them. Uh, they're so cute to watch. Um, but yeah, anyway, like I was saying, plot was great, characters are great, animation was great. Music, particularly in this episode, I really liked. It's kind of like the one with uh, Rain and Ida where uh, there was that music in that episode. I would say that that episode and then this one had music throughout the episode that I really that I enjoyed. Um, yeah, music was great. Uh, overall, great episode. <laughs> I don't know. I don't, I've forgotten how many episodes are even left of this season. I hope it's like another like 10 because if not, stuff's really going to have to start ramping up and happening and I'm not looking forward to that. I'm just... I don't want to even, like, because then I know there's only three episodes after that, so I, for season three, so I don't, I don't want the series again, even though I know it, it was canceled and everything, but anyway, yeah, those are my thoughts for this episode, I hope you enjoyed this reaction, if you like early access to my full and edited reactions, go join my Patreon, link in the description and pinned comment below, but anyway, have a wonderful morning, afternoon, night, and keep bringing bright, guys, see ya!